Let's quickly go through our branch policies. If you enable any of the branch policies on a particular branch, then you cannot delete that. So it is a way of protecting your branch. For this main branch, let's go to our branch policies. And if you enable any of the policies, you will not be able to delete this branch. The first policy is require a minimum number of reviewers. This makes sure that your code is put, uh, you know, the PR that you create is properly reviewed. The second one is check for linked work items. You can make it required or optional and you can do the same for comment resolution. The next is the limiting merge types. If you want to disallow or you want to make sure that any of the, you know, merge type is not available, you can enable this. Next is the build validation. So you can run a build here and you know, uh, whenever there is a merge, uh, the pipeline will run. And if the build is successful, only then a merge can be completed. So you can link the build pipeline here. And every time you create a PR to main, that pipeline will run. The status checks. This requires other services to post successful status to complete pull requests. And the last one automatically include reviewers. So if you want, you know, a, a team lead or someone who uh, has to give approval for all the merges to main, you can add them here and you don't need to add them manually uh, in each map PRs. And yeah, this is how you can enable uh, any of the policy that you seek for your main branch or any of the branches. These policies are particularly important for your main branch. Uh, because you don't want you know anyone to delete it so you make sure that you have some policies there minimum reviewers is something that we always have uh, there is also a build validation that we usually have and uh, you can also have uh, include you can also include you know automatically a reviewer's name so it can be your team lead or someone else so yeah this 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 is all about you know the branch policies that's available in azure devops uh, so if you if this uh, video was helpful please do like and subscribe